Welcome to Coffee Break. My name is Michael Moret. I've mentioned to you folks in the past that I was deathly afraid of public speaking when I was in school. I never liked to talk at all, let alone in front of people. So it took me a long time, actually a lot of prayers, before I was convinced that God was calling me to do this and to preach and teach his word. Um, and so because of how I was, actually for the first, I don't know how long, Several times, many, many times, when I first started, I was just so nervous, whether it was in a church or any place. I was so nervous to stand up in front of people, and I had been doing it for a while. And I remember one time I was invited to this church, and to make matters worse, this church, this church was filled with uh, doctors and nurses and college professors and here I am you know and I I'm sitting up on the stage and this is one of those churches where they had chairs behind the pulpit <clears throat> for people to sit and I was one of course I was sitting there you know and looking over the congregation song service was going on and nervous as usual nervous as usual so I prayed I prayed God why am I so nervous? Help me to get over this. Help me to do a good job. Help me not to be nervous. And, you know, and boy, I didn't hear an audible voice from God, but I'd say it was pretty close. And it was as if God said to me, Mike, I will tell you why you are nervous. Okay? It's because you care what those people think of you. Why do you care what those people think of you? You're not the issue. I'm the issue. They may be doctors. They may be nurses. They may be professors. They may be very important people in the eyes of the world. But you are going to proclaim my word and I'm more important than any of them. You are not the issue. Don't worry about if they approve of you or not. Man, I got to tell you how much that set me free. That clicked with me, and I've got to say, I have not been nervous since that day, 34 years ago, probably, 35 years ago. I haven't been nervous since, <clears throat> because I don't care what people think of me. I'm up there to do a job, or I'm teaching to do a job, and that job is to proclaim the Word of God as clearly as I can, so that people understand who God is, and hear the message of God. I'm not an issue. I'm not the issue at all. And that took all the pressure off me. I'm just a spokesman. That's all. I don't care if you like me or you don't like me. As long as I do my job, you see. And it set me free. So, no matter what we're called by God to do, it's important for us to see that God is the issue, not us. It doesn't matter if people like us or not, or applaud us or not. The important thing is, are we faithful to do what God wants us to do, regardless of what anybody might think? It's a good lesson to learn. One that I learned really helped me. Until next time, Michael Moret for Coffee Break. So long.